Hi, I'm Ron Fernandez in Irvine, California. I'm going to show you how I make finger and thumb picks for playing the Portuguese guitar. Finger picks for the Portuguese guitarra are called unhas, which also means fingernails. Here's a typical unha for the thumb. It is made of polypropylene. Notice how it is curved similar to the shape of the natural nail. There are two kinds of uñas for the index finger. The Coimbra and the Lisboa. The playing edge of the Coimbra uña is rounded like the natural fingertip. Here's the playing edge. Here's the playing edge. This uña is made of plastic which looks like tortoise shell. The Lisboa style has a corner which is 90 degrees to 120. This uña is made of acrylic and this one is made of polypropylene. Here's another Lisbon style uña. Here's the playing tip. Professional players in Portugal usually make their own uñas and attach them with tape. I use clear surgical tape. Most players make uñas of synthetic material such as polypropylene or acrylic which is a half a millimeter to a millimeter thick. This material is about 0.8 millimeters thick. The acrylic or polypropylene sheets have to be bent so we make a wooden mold. This is for the index finger and this is for the thumb. I'm going to show you how I make these. They're very simple.
Simple as that. Here's how I make a cardboard template. I fold the cardboard in half, then I draw my finger right there, so, and then I draw my thumb, right there. Next I take a piece of tape, I put it on my, my finger, and I draw the outline of my fingernail. I can put that right onto the template right here. Do the same thing with my thumb. Take a piece of tape. and then you can fold it in half and cut it out. And do the same with the other side. It's pretty good too. And then you just cut out the whole thumb and the index finger template. Very fast, very accurate. Take the material out of the form, and now we outline it. Now we have to cut this section out here. We take the material and put it into a vise so we can cut the hole. Now I, I could use a drill but I have a, a very nice grinding stone that's cone-shaped that works very well. <laughs>